Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm going to discuss how we can recover deleted messages on our messenger on Facebook. If you're interested in this question, please keep watching this video till the end. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell button to get notifications about my new videos. Let's go! So now let's, for example, go to our messenger and here I'm going to show you first of all how we can, uh, for example, manage our chats with archive function. So basically what we can do, uh, for example, I can press on it and go to archive or just, uh, I would say, move it to archive. So let's press on it. And as you can see, this chat disappeared. But if we want to somehow return uh, from archive our chats, what we can do, so we need to press on the menu. And here we can go to archive. So it's basically pretty simple. Then we need to wait a little bit. And as you can see, now I can see this chat. So we now need to press on it and to on archive. So we pressed on it. Let's return to our chats. And here it is, as you can see. And so now let's go to our specific topic of this video, which is how we can rec uh, recover deleted messages from man Messenger. So we don't basically have a function here exactly in Messenger application, but we have it on the website. So basically, we need to go inside the website of Facebook and you need to log into the account on what you want to receive uh messages messages from to recover messages from so here we need to press on the menu sign and then we need to swipe to the end and press on settings next we need to swipe to the bottom and here we'll see uh, the setting which is called download your information download a copy of your information to keep or to transfer to another server so let's press on it in here, now we're going to see several settings that are going to help us to uh, recover our deleted messages and not only them. So we're here and as you can see, you can download a copy of your Facebook information at any time. You can download a complete copy or you can select only the types of information and date ranges you want. So now let's go inside and here's so basically your activity across Facebook. So here we can pick and choose whether or not we want to, for example, download a specific type of data. So as you can see, saved items in collections. So for example, I don't need it. A voting locations and reminders, I don't need it. Maybe posts, I don't need it. And pages, polls, etc. So for example, let's imagine that we need specifically messages. So let's delete everything from here like this. So let's imagine that we did all of it. And so then you can see personal information, etc. connections, a logged information, security and login information. And so let's do the and here you will see one of the most important setting here is date range for all of my data or data range. So basically, you can choose specific date from and specific date to uh, a range of date that you want to receive your data from. And so after you chose, you can uh, choose format. So HTML or, J or JSON. I recommend using HTML. So we could uh, actually, we will be able to open it through our browser. So next, what we need to do is just to, uh, and also media quality, I suggest doing medium or low because this will actually affect on the size of our files and also on the uh, amount of time that we need to spend to download it. So let's press on create file. And after this, as you can see, we will see available copies. So here as you can see it's uh, for now, it's just pending. But after some time, you can go here and you will see that you will be able to download this specific file. After uh, you, do, you do this, you will be able to open this file. And uh, there you will see all the different folders, all the different, I would say, files connecting with different types of data that you chose to download and specifically your messages. There you will see uh, a photos or screenshots of any of your chats with all the dates and all the timestamps, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. And so just like that, I showed you how we can recover deleted messages and also recover them from archive. 
on Facebook. And I hope that this video was informative and helpful for you. If it was, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button to get notifications about my new videos.